Today's video is going to be about slicing using the Cricut Design Space to put some pictures inside some words so that we can put them on the shirts. So this video is for Charlotte. She's new to crafting. She's doing very good and she now does shirts. So she wants to add some different features. So I'm doing this video for you, Charlotte. So we're going to go to Google. Let's look for African prints. Click on images. I like this image. It's very bright and festive. And then I'm going to click on it. And I'm going to save image as. So I'm going to name it because if you don't name it, it's hard to find a computer. Can print some more. So we're going to save it. Let's replace it. So we're going to click out of here. Open up the design space. Push upload. Upload. Upload images. Let's browse. Let's go to download and look for the African print one. Here we go right here. We're going to open it up. We'll push complex, push continue. We're not going to do anything to it, so we're just going to apply and continue. Click on it, and we're going to save it into our recent uploads. Okay, then we're going to go to text. So I'm going to use the word love. And we don't want to use skinny love. We want to use a thicker font. So I'm going to look for birthday bash. Birthday. That's not what I want to use. Hmm. Why I can't search for the damn cricket? Birthday bash. All right, we're gonna leave that alone. We don't want that one. Let me look for birthday bash. Cause birthday bash is a large font. So here go birthday bash. This only current font. I don't know what that means. Because I'm going to open it up for birthday bash. bash and then I'm going to type in love. So I like these. I like the college fonts. It's big. It's nice. You can put pictures in it. So let's go back to our uploaded African print. We're not going to do anything to the word. We're not going to, it's very, right now it's ungrouped. We're not going to ungroup it. We're just going to leave it alone. Let's just put this over top of it. Unlock it. And let's drag it across the page. So we can start from top to bottom. It's going to slice. We can start from bottom to top. And it was still sliced. So let's go right here now and slice it. So now that we sliced it, it didn't slice. So let's find out why it didn't slice. Oh, it did slice. <laughs> I did it. All right, so there you go. It sliced out the word love. I I just didn't remove it fast enough. But So we're going to get rid of that. We're going to get rid of this. There you go, Charlotte. There go your word, love. Let me try that again. One more time. Let's look for a different font. And I got a lot of fonts in here. She likes name brand stuff. The mail. All 
All right. Big old Louis Vuitton. Y'all know I love me some Louis Vuitton, even though I ain't even got none. Nothing name brand in my house. So let's take Louis Vuitton. Stretch it out. Let's start from the bottom, go up. We're going to slice it. And then we're going to take this away. And there you go. Now you got love. And Louis Vuitton. Love in African print. I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Check out my divas. Sign up for the Facebook group, Crafting Together as One. Check out my videos, y'all. Hit me up. And please don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for the new notifications to let you know what I'm doing next. Bye. Thanks for watching.